next week. Hooray! We'll be getting hands-on helping everybody with the installation next week, but Patrick couldn't resist this question from Jason. He writes, with people getting ready to migrate to Windows 7 now, is a good time to make sure all the drivers on your system are up to date. I was wondering if Patrick or Veronica had any favorite picks for automated driver updaters. Remember, free is always better. Oh my Jason. goodness. I've never found like a paid automatic driver update tool that I like. I just like it. Your your favorite driver updater. <laughs> yeah, because you know. It's really something you get passionate about. Well, I gotta say, I'm, I am going to get passionate about okay. this. Squee. <laughs> the, uh, look, most paid driver update tools, as far as I'm concerned, pretty much outright suck. If you found one you love, feel free to email us, techsell at revision3.com. But look, Windows Update has been doing really fine by me on XP Vista and Windows 7, especially Windows 7. Now, we should probably also talk about the, if you, if you, you probably are thinking it's more like collecting all of your drivers before you go to Windows 7, and you're going to want to download fresh Windows 7 drivers, dot, 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 but the truth is, Windows 7 does a really good job finding drivers for most of your hardware, unless you have some really old, really obscure hardware. Mm -hmm. Have you I mean, found you can usually go to the to the support page and download the drivers that you need. Yeah, I mean, go to the you know if, if you have like some you know like fourth party printer that nobody's ever heard of, see if there's a Vista driver for it. Right, go straight to the source, Intel, AMD, Nvidia, whoever makes your mm -hmm. you know your camera, whatever it is. And and if your vendor doesn't have Windows 7 drivers, try selling the Vista drivers. And I know you want a tool that's going to collect everything together and you know burn it to a CD for you, so you have it ready as soon as, or actually probably just dump it on a thumb drive as soon as you're installing. Mm -hmm. But the truth is, Windows 7 is probably going to find all of the drivers on your system. If it doesn't, you really need to go to the vendor's website and download the latest drivers.